On Friday, the mayor's office and IMPD confirming this threat, saying the investigation remains open and ongoing. And all of this as the mayor pushes for more gun control here in Indianapolis. I am not backing down. Democratic Mayor Joe Hogsett taking a strong stance at Wednesday's public safety meeting as his proposed plan to help reduce gun violence passes out of committee. These policies were selected because they are supported by the vast, vast majority of the people of the city of Indianapolis. However, the mayor said he's receiving pushback from gun lobbyists and politicians, something he anticipated. But what he didn't expect was direct and personal threats. I hope and I pray that none of you will experience those kinds of threats. Thank you, Ms. Clark. And this gun control proposal calls for raising the age to purchase a firearm to 21, banning assault rifles, and ending permitless and concealed carry here in Indianapolis. A package of gun safety measures. It's an announcement Mayor Hogsett made right before Memorial Day weekend. Since then, the city also announced its first gun-free zone for the Wonder Road Music Festival at Garfield Park this weekend. IMPD will continue working with neighborhoods and event organizers across Marin County to maximize safety in our community. Friday, IMPD and the mayor declined to comment further on the nature of these threats and how many were made. Now, it's important to note that this proposal won't have an immediate impact because state law prohibits cities from regulating anything involving guns. But the full council will make a final vote on this proposal next month.